Here in Makale is the capital of Tigray, members of the Young Men Christian Association. In collaboration with the Organization for Social Service, Health and Development, have been holding a breakfast feeding program for children for over a year now by raising a community-based support. Yerga Gavramedhan, coordinator of the program, says the number of children beneficiaries of the program has declined greatly from day to day as the support from the community dwindled due to the economic crisis. Uh, a total of four sites we were managing. Uh, one is totally for the IDP children in Savakari. The three sites were for the host community, children for, from host community. Uh, but now it's only one site which is functioning that we are observing now. Why we reduce from four to one is uh, because of lack of support. Yerga added that it is truly really painful to turn back starved children every day due to lack of support. Mm, it's very painful to see a child coming here, but because we don't have any bread, sending them back is very painful. We are experiencing painful uh, uh, times. According to Yerga, in addition to the breakfast feeding program, the youngsters are helping the children to get child-based psychosocial therapy and informal education. The children is not going to school, is uh, impacting their future. So we start informal education. So after this uh, program, they will go to the YMCA compound, so they will receive uh, at least informal education, at least to remind them how to write and read. This is what we are doing. In addition to that, uh, I believe the war and its impact in the children is heavy. I observe when they heard some uh, noise, uh, even a truck passing, you see them uh, shocking. That means uh, this is from the drone attack and uh, uh, war jet attacks they observed in a previous time. So trauma healing is uh, important for them. So a child-friendly psychosocial support should be provided. That's what we are doing. Yerga also says the feeding program will have been faded out once basic services are resumed in Makale, the capital of Tigray that the parents of the children would be able to get access to their savings and feed their own children. The moment the bank open, this program will die. So we are uh, waiting in a very hopeful uh, spirit, commercial activities to be started, banks to be operated, and to stop this program. Yerga calls to all Ethiopians to support the signed peace agreement and suggests the Tigrayan and Ethiopian governments to be committed to implement the signed agreement on the ground. My first call is to all citizens who love peace to support this peace agreement. Uh, for the conflicting parties, now they are not conflicting parties. They are parties in agreement for peace. So. I, my call is to keep their promise. We are observing uh, a good steps. The aid is already arriving. The problem is it's not uh, to the level of uh, the reality in the ground. I hope it will be increased. And there are other activities that we are expecting, including the activation of uh, bank, telecommunication, and so on.